just the one shutting guy. Which one is it? This one is shutting. I'll leave this one open. Then, when that's done, so you just close that last flap. So one closed, one open, and I'll lock them. The second one will now shut. We'll leave the vent open. You might hear a beep as my phone gets an acknowledgement saying that the uh, windows are locked. If I, if I press that, it might sh it shuts that last bit. There we go. Fabulous. So these controls are via the internet, via the Wi-Fi. So if the Wi-Fi goes down, they don't work, which is a bit surprising, but there we go. If the internet goes down, they talk to the web server. These ones are sh short distance radio ones, so these work all the time, they're just battery powered. Interesting thing is this hive heating thing also talks to the internet, but if the internet goes down, it will manage to operate remotely by itself. The router, which coincidentally I worked on, um, can work autonomously but obviously not with your phone app, which I'm surprised this one doesn't do, considering these have got sharp distance radio communication to the wee box in them as well. But there you go. That's just a software issue. But that is the Velox Active Control thing. And they will open and shut if it gets too hot or if it gets too humid and you can get them to open and shut at particular times in the day with the phone app. But I've currently got that turned off because it's winter. But when we do cooking and things, sometimes I turn it on. But very pleased with them, very pleased.